We do not have the testing data to make real sense of our reality beyond what we know is the face of it for an overwhelming number who gets sick. And that face is mine. I tested positive. Let's use this example of me having it as proof that you can get it to, God forbid. We have to do everything we can to avoid being sick. We have to do it for ourselves, our families, and for those on the front lines who are saving the lives of people like me and many of you, together as ever as one. Tom Hanks and Rita Wilson are being kept in isolation after announcing Wednesday they have the coronavirus. I just wanted to share my news with you guys and I will keep you updated as how I'm doing. I could have made a decision to put myself maybe in a separate room or stay away and I'm sure that people are making those decisions and are tough decisions mm -hmm. to make but I made the decision to want to be with him and you know no, still touch him. <laughs> yeah. Thank you for all of your love and kind messages. It made me feel very happy and very hopeful and very loved. But that wasn't the reason why I posted that post. Um, I posted the post telling you guys that I had corona to really stress the importance of self-quarantine. I wanted to let you know that yesterday I tested positive for COVID-19. Uh, the disease caused by the coronavirus. I woke up this morning and I felt like a new man. Uh, I feel like the medicine has started to work and I've lost a lot of the symptoms that I used to have. Um, there's no more fever or body aches. Thanks for watching. Watch more clips here and subscribe to our channel here. See ya. The universe of this is so strong. So to, to like find out that Kit Harrington was a real person, that was that was a, that was a, that was a, that was a, that was a blast. She's in uh, Hollywood. She's the mother, essentially, of the boys in a sense. She's caretaking, gives advice, yells at them. She probably has like one of the worst potty mouths on television, period. Before, <laughs> and I had never had a voiceover audition. Um, and so it's kind of long story, long story short, my team ended up getting Jamie on the phone, the casting director. Rudy Gobert tested positive for the virus. The positive test coming just days after Gobert mocked the virus by touching all of the microphones and recorders in front of him at a press conference. The next day, Gobert's teammate, all-star guard Donovan Mitchell, tested positive as well. I'm asymptomatic. You know, I don't have any symptoms. Um, I could walk down the street if, you know, if it wasn't public knowledge that uh, I was sick. Uh, you wouldn't know it, you know, and I think that's the scariest part about this virus. Detroit Pistons forward Christian Wood, seen here playing against Gobert, tested positive. Now Gobert is apologizing for the way he handled the corona outbreak. I wish I would have took this thing more seriously, and I hope everyone else will do so because we can do it together. On the advice of the chief medical officer, I've taken a test that has come out positive, so I am working from home, I'm self-isolating. The mayor of Miami, Florida, Francis Suarez, has tested positive for the coronavirus. I've had a diary going every single day since I was since I tested positive for COVID-19 to try to reduce anxieties and fears. Peter Dutton, a senior minister in the cabinet, has spent hours with colleagues in the last few days and he's tested positive now to COVID-19. Prince Albert II of Monaco has tested positive for the coronavirus. I think the other thing that's probably gone on with the stock market today is that uh, there may be a little bit of rejoicing that they see that it's very unlikely that Bernie Sanders will now be the nominee of the Democrat Party. With regards to the travel ban from Europe, I'm not quite sure why that's an important part of this. I think uh, social distancing is perhaps most important. Hola a todos. Sé que han habido muchos rumores con con mi estado de salud, pero estoy bien. He estado acá en constante exámenes. 